morning, Empower Nation. Let's start the day off with a pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag with the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Well, welcome. Let's Good morning. See. It is May 26th. Tuesday. Yes. It's week 10 of distance learning, for those of you that are counting. And there are eight school days left. Eight school days. Four days this week, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Four days next week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. And we stick a fork in it and we're done. Not that we're done yet, but on the 4th of June we're done. Okay, um, So keep on working, keep on getting that stuff in. What else we got going on here? Uh, new week, so new goals. Send us your goals for the whole week. If you have an overall weekly goal. Um, and today, just kind of what's your plan? We'd love to hear about it. Uh, today is give your dog a treat to keep her quiet day. So um, <laughs> if, you, if you have a whiny dog when you're trying to do a video, uh, giving your dog a treat is a good thing. Also remember that um, keep working, keep turning stuff in. You can turn stuff into the bus any day, um, Monday, well, Tuesday through Friday this week, and we'll get it um, next week as well. Monday through Thursday, we'll get it, no problem. If you want to work over the summer, you can turn stuff into the office. The buses might not be running. Most likely they won't be. Um, okay, here you go. Uh, most likely they won't be, but um, we will be. We'll have a presence. I'm here for Adult Basic Ed, 3:30 to 5:30 on Wednesdays in June. So every Wednesday in June, I'm here 3:30 to 5:30. So feel free to um, come on in if you have any questions. Um, I will we'll definitely be under 10 people, so we can we can support that. So yeah. that'll be June and August that we'll have the Wednesday afternoon summer school. We haven't made the overall decision yet. We'll probably know by next week, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, there will be a, a more traditional summer school, summer school but that's usually yeah. for, um, you know, the, high, the regular high school students. You guys get to continue your summer with the way that you do your regular school year. So yeah. if you want to keep learning all summer, nothing yeah. has to change about what we've been doing. Right. Um, just keep up the communication so we know how to get the work to you and how to get yep. the work that yep. you've dropped off to us. And the easiest way to do that, like we said, is the exchange through the high school office. Yep, excellent way to do that. Leave it there. We'll leave you um, stuff to work on. Perfect. Um, what else we have? A summer meals survey. So the school um, and the band are both working on different options for summer meals. And so we sent out a survey last week. I sent it out to those of you that are on Remind. Um, if you weren't on Remind, if you aren't yet, please join us on Remind. But regardless, uh, Jensen sent out the survey via text to those of you that are not on Remind. Um, have somebody in your household fill out that survey. It helps the school district know what we need to be doing for um, lunches for the summer. If you're interested, if that's a need, a want, if it's something feasible that you could, you know, get to a location to pick up those meals, things like that. So please take a look for that survey. If you didn't see it and you want us to resend it, obviously let us know. Excellent. All right. The education tip for the day. Um, here's something you can throw on your phones if you have a phone, or you can go to the website. It will be down in the comment section. Uh, below so you can check it out uh, but it is deals with um, construction careers there is an app that you can get it's called construction trades app so construction trades type that in either Google um, Samsung or our galaxy or Apple stores all have the app um, you set up an account and it um, lets you explore the trades uh, electrician plumber construction worker, all of those trades that are out there. If you don't have an iPhone, 
and you want to use just the uh, website, you have access to a website, constructioncareers.org. Um, Again, all that information will be down in the comment section. So check it out. Oh, Sadie. Sadie, what is the saying for the week that we're going to go by? Oh, now you don't want to talk. <laughs> okay. Sure, now you're quiet. So think about this all week long as you are out and about. Confidence is not, they will like me. Confidence is, I will be fine if they don't. Think about that. All right. That'll be down in the comment section for you to read as well. Yes. And finally, the question of the day, what you've all been waiting for, or at least fast forwarded to, um, so you can get to it. Um, who are five people you spend most time with? Who are the five people recently you've been spending the most time with? You. Uh, yep. <laughs> uh, Rob, Colleen, Anders. Yep. And could be anybody else that works at the high school, I guess. So, um, prob probably Adrian. Oh, okay. Yep. 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 All right. All right. Good. For me, my five are obviously you, <laughs> Pam, my dad. Um, let's see. Uh, my sister's been doing um, working from home, but at our farm. So um, I'm spending a lot of time with my sister lately. And uh, let's see, who else? Wow. I have a large social um, environment that I hang out with. Uh, who would be the fifth person? Uh, probably anybody here in the high school then. Um, or when we take Sadie over to the elementary school. So anyway, who are the five people you spend most of your time with? Um, let us know either in the comment section below or give us a call, text us. You know the drill um, by now. So uh, just uh, inform us that you've watched the video and you can answer the question of the day. Sadie, is there anything else that we forgot? Besides, boy, you are just rammy today. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> all right, if that's the case, remember always, you, we are in power, you are in power. Have a great start to your week. Yes, make it a good one, everybody.